Hi, my name is Paul Key, and uh, I'm going to put together a quick crudo with uh, Ludomir, which is a Mediterranean sea bass. So there's a few basic components that I use in a lot of my dishes, and it's one is salt. So I get a little bit of Maldon sea salt, some white soy sauce, so that's my salt component, fat, which is extremely important. I'm going to use olive oil and acid, which I'm going to use lemons, and uh, I have some uh, shallots that I pickled in some rice vinegar. So those are my only ingredients. I'm gonna garnish it with some fresh herbs because I just love the flavor of fresh herbs, as well as some tomatoes and some jalapenos for some spice. So this is gonna be really quick. I'm gonna start off with a piece of um, Ludomir that I, I filleted earlier. Since I skinned this fish, I left a little bit of the membrane on, on here. That membrane can be a little bit tough. This layer of uh, skin is actually the layer between the actual fish flesh and the fish skin. I usually score it. And I'm just gonna slice this thinly. Sushi is all about texture. And you can create texture by how you cut the fish and um, how you manipulate the vegetable. I'll do six slices, nice and even. I'm gonna pair that with some thinly sliced jalapeno because the fish is so delicate. And I'm gonna pair that with some thinly sliced tomatoes as well. Not so thin because I like the texture of the tomato. And a little bit of a micro brinois of garlic. Brinois is probably the smallest cut that uh, you would do in uh, culinary school or in a French kitchen. But uh, at the restaurant, we cut it a little bit smaller. <laughs> Just because uh, raw fish can be so really, really delicate and you never want to uh, overpower the flavor of the fish. The important part, especially with raw fish, of um, brinoiling it versus just mincing the garlic, it's because when you mince garlic, you release more of the oils. So it's gonna tend to be a little bit stronger and more, uh, more pungent in garlic. So as you can tell, this is a super simple dish. And it's, it's generally what the types of dishes that I prepare at home because, uh, you know, as a chef, I'm always at the restaurant, always working, and I like doing simple, simple food. So I'm gonna put that in, in my bowl. I'm gonna put, put a little bit of the garlic on here. Actually, I enjoy putting together really, really simple dishes. I like putting together really simple dishes, but making them look like they're, you know, fancier than they, they, they are, I guess. I like making dishes look pretty. That's what attracted me to, to sushi in the beginning. It's all about the aesthetic. Because I think uh, most people, they eat with their eyes first. I'm gonna dress uh, everything with a little bit of white soy, which is actually, white soy is soy sauce that's more, um, has more wheat than uh, soy. And it has a very uh, like strong fermented flavor. And I'm gonna dress everything generously with olive oil. I think that uh, raw fish can take a lot of uh, fat. It actually complements the richness of the fish. And then I'm gonna take, uh, some cilantro, some really nice, pretty leaves of cilantro. Put that on the plate and uh, garnish with some, uh, some opal, opal basil buds. Finish the whole thing with a little bit of maldon. Lemon zest. and a little fresh squeeze of acid in the end. I think uh, raw fish especially can take a nice fresh squeeze of acid to brighten everything up. This is my uh, crudo.